Hey guys, what's up? It's Rumor Ray here, showing you guys another video. In today's video, I will be showing you guys the new update that's coming out in Rock League. Uh, I know you guys have probably already seen this video a hundred times, but I already had this video recorded and stuff, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it out for you guys anyway. So if you didn't know, if you weren't watching the RLCS Championship or anything like that, Rock League, they actually put out a video at the end showing that the new update that's coming soon will be July 5th, and it's because of the two-year anniversary. Now, I will be leaving a link of the video in the description. If I were you guys, I would just listen to this video and then go over to the other one just because this is more in depth uh, than the um the video so without further ado let's get started with the video so it's called rock league's anniversary update it's launching july the 5th uh they revealed at the uh, after the rlcs and it will also be the start of season five as just want to put out so season four is ending july 5th so if you need to get any of your ranks up you have a good month or two to do it so that's fine like that so the first thing that they showed in the video is a new arena. So it's a new arena. It's free for everyone. They're bringing us a standard arena. It's called the Champions Field. It celebrates the pure competition found in Rock League. Completed with massive statue fee featuring a shield logo, triple decker seating, and, and enough stadium lighting to make your match visible from outer space. So that's that. That's one thing. Everyone gets a new free stadium, which would be pretty cool. New scenery added. A season four rewards in competitive season five. So there was a lot of like debate over what the season four rewards would be, and I'm kind of let down by this, but it's the trail. So I don't know if you guys know, but like right there, it just showed up the purple trail. When you hit supersonic speed, which is your max speed, you might see it a couple times in this video, right there again. But your trail changes colors. So our anniversary update also marks the end of competitive season four and the beginning of season five. Blah 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 blah. The end of competitive season 4 also means that a new wave of season rewards are coming. Each rank, bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, and champion will have their own reward, while grand champion gets the champion reward plus an in-game title. As for the rewards and stuff, we're doing something much different this time around with new trails as the rewards. Trails, as they will be called after the anniversary update, is live, are activated when you achieve supersonic speed, which is when you hit your max speed. That White purple tr blue trail you now see behind your battle car can be replaced with a season reward trail or any other custom trails that we'll be rolling out in future updates in crates. So they're saying that there will be more trails that you can have in crates and your season 4 reward will be a crate. I mean, will be a um, trail. Just the super size thing. But that kind of confuses me because already it's already like purple. So I'm trying to figure out what like the champions one would be, but whatever. Okay, so with this new update, they're also dropping new crates. The new crates are called the Overdrive Crate. There's new wheels, decals, black market items. So right there, they just confirmed that they are coming out with new black market uh, decals. Hopefully a lot, maybe like multiple. The Overdrive, Overdrive Crate has two battle cars, two new import battle cars. And they showed these cars in the actual trailer uh, called the Anonymous GP and the Ciento V17. Now, I probably pronounced these wrong, but the Anonymous... GP kind of looks like a uh, Formula 1 race car, and the Ciento V17 kind of looks like one of those really fast cars from GTA, actually. So I'm kind of, I feel like they kind of got the idea off of that, but I don't really feel like those cars are going to be that good just because they are kind of like faster cars. They look faster. They don't look like they could be better than any of these cars, but that doesn't really matter. As for the rest of the anniversary update, we have a ton of additional content coming up next month, including updated engine audio system, new soundtrack options, achievements and trophies, go explosions, and more. We have much more updates as we draw closer to the anniversary. So that is the end of the update right there. But I want to go in a little bit more depth and just cover everything that happened, because it was a lot of stuff. To begin with, they are bringing us a new, a new map. So it's probably going to be looking like this, just it's like a big stadium, it's like an actual stadium. Which will be pretty cool. They're bringing us... It's the end of season 4, start of season 5. And we're getting new trails for our supersonic speed. And so season 5 will begin July 5th. So if you want to get your rank up, you have to hurry up and do it. I mean, don't really have to hurry up. You have a whole month to do it. So that's fine like that. They're bringing a new crate called the Overdrive Crate. And remember, I want to remind you guys right here. When they do bring the Overdrive Crate, they are taking out the CC... The uh, Champion Series crates... So that's a big thing to look out for. They have new wheels, new decals, new black market items, and new cars. And it's just going to be a big update. Um, 
when the rest of the stuff come out i will upload a video right away for you guys and that should be all for the video guys um i'm gonna keep the rest of this game up just because it was a pretty good game uh for my level if you would say so but that's gonna be all for the video i'll see you guys next time